Welcome Cancers, I'm back y'all with another video. This is going to be for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, as well as North Node. All right, so these are general reads. Take what resonates and leave what does not resonate with you. All right, so if you are new to my channel, welcome guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. Go ahead and consider clicking that subscribe button. Don't forget to click the bell for notifications. So you won't miss out on any future videos, all right? So let's talk, my cancers. Let's talk and let's see what we got coming in for the month of February. All right, so what message do we have for my cancers? What messages are there for my cancers? All right, so ooh, at the bottom of the deck, we got the lovers and the ten of pentacles and the two of cups and the three of pentacles and the hierophant. Ooh, cancers. It looks like y'all are working on building a partnership, a love romance that is like equal give and take where you both are building and working and you all are on the same page, hunties. I got some of this sage and dust on my fingers. Um, yes, it looks like y'all are working together, honey, and coming together, being on the same page. Like, love is in the air, honey. I'm loving it, okay? We got the Four of Cups, the Six of Wands, the Two of Wands, the Eight of Swords, the Knight of Pentacles, the Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, Seven of Cups, Eight of Cups, and the King of Wands. All right, so right off the bat, I'm seeing that somebody wants to work on a partnership or work on something built. I'm getting like a, this is either like a business connection or a romantic connection. Or both. But I'm getting like, some of you could be dealing with the Gemini, but I'm getting like, there is someone who wants to work on something here. But I'm getting like, you're feeling like if you aren't all the way ready, because I got you guys' this first energy popping out as the Four of Cups. Now, we know the Four of Cups energy is like, mm, I don't know. I don't know about that. Okay, you got all these different cups down here. And then you got this cup, this opportunity being presented. And you're like, mm, I don't really know about that. And I feel like you may feel like that because you're not sure if it's going to be successful. You don't want to put your hand and dimple in it if it's not going to be successful. So, I feel like... The two of wands, you're preparing, you're preparing, making plans. Because this walking into something new with this ace of cups is like, mm, this is shaky ground. I don't know too much about that, okay? And this is something that you've been thinking about. You're kind of really kind of like over obsessing, thinking about, you know, this decision, okay? Now, I feel like you were moving kind of slow towards this decision, making this decision, in the past but it looks like the ace of pentacles is future energy so this opportunity is here this uh the universe is handing you a new fresh opportunity so we got the ace of cups and the ace of pentacles all right so let's get some clarifiers why is the four of cups here yeah see we got the six of pentacles i feel like you don't want to you don't want to um invest or put anything on it if it isn't going to be a give and take situation okay so i feel like some of y'all are kind of like waiting you know waiting to see eight of pentacles here some of you may be getting ready to uh venture out into doing your own business doing your own thing because i feel like some of y'all are getting ready to leave a job that's for some of you yeah, see, I'm getting like, there is getting ready to be a new beginning. I feel like you're getting ready to take a leap of faith into something new. Um, there's an offer here on the table as well. I feel like you know this is, I feel like you know what it is that you need to do or you feel like what would be best, but you're still kind of hesitant. I feel like you're hesitating. 
because you don't want to miss something or you don't want to miss this opportunity. Okay. So I feel like you're you're deciding to make a final decision. And like I said, for a lot of you, it's in love. Here's this love energy. The lovers, ten of pentacles, that two of cups. Okay, that three of pentacles. Some of y'all are working on a marriage. Some of you guys have been separ separated from um, a lover. And this is your chance. <laughs> this is your chance to take things serious, okay? All right, so let's let's see what's going on. I do want to see why the Six of Pentacles is here. Okay. You don't want to get your hopes up. That's what it is. The star. You don't want to get your hopes up. You may not want to get somebody else's hopes up. Like, hey, we're going to work on this. Um, yeah, this is what it's going to be. But I feel like either you don't want to get your hopes up or you don't want to get someone else's hopes up. Okay. Because you want to make sure that this is the right thing to do. All right, so the two of wands, I feel like you're making plans, like you're planning things out in your head, like you're, you know, envisioning your desired outcome or how you think things would go in your head. Why is the two of wands here? Ten of wands, yeah. See, you're picturing this to be a burden. Um, this situation could be, like, really burdensome. You're picturing this as being, like, really burdensome. So you're kind of like, I don't know. Why is the Ten of Wands here? The Four of Wands. This could have something to do with your stability, okay? We got King of Cups, you, you guys' energy, and the Six of Swords, all right? So, yeah, like, you're looking at this as, like, this would be a lot of responsibility, so you don't want to get your hopes up or you don't want to get this other person hopes up because this is a lot of responsibility. See, we got you guys energy queen of cups here, king of cups. This could be with a partner, a twin flame, a soulmate. Okay, we got king of cups and queen of cups here. Knight of Pentacles is Capricorn's energy. You could be dealing with the Capricorn. But you may have felt like somebody's trying to pressure you or put, uh, you know, you feel forced to make a decision. But I just don't feel like, I feel like in the past you didn't want the responsibility or you didn't want, you like you didn't have all the rules or you didn't have the layout, the blueprint to make this happen or make, or feel, to feel comfortable doing this, taking this leap of faith. Some of y'all are afraid to be exposed by friends or people in a group. Queen of Wands and the Moon and the Strength card. It's okay, we got Leo's energy here. Somebody here could have been Ooh, I'm getting it. There was some type of disagreement possibly with the Leo. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, or Pisces. But I'm getting it. There was this big showdown right here with the Five of Wands and the Five of Swords. That's possibly why you don't want to get your hopes up because you don't want this, uh, this energy, this Five of Swords and Five of Wands backstabbing energy conflict energy I have six of wands here the magician yeah so you want to make your best move you want to make i feel like y'all are playing chess like you want to make your next move your best move yeah see this is something new <laughs> this is something new this is a new opportunity why is the ace of pentacles here the empress okay we got the empress here i'm getting a lot of growth Okay, someone's mother here could be involved as well. But I'm getting like, look at this. We got the nine of pentacles and the three of pentacles. This is something that you guys are working on. It's, it's something here that you guys are building from the ground up that you're working on. Okay, I'm getting a lot of growth. I'm getting a lot of growth. Temperance. I'm getting a lot of growth. And you guys could be using your creative energy and I'm just getting like you guys are growing in some aspect of business, work, career. I'm getting like there's some type of growth. 
something's been holding you back and you're not wanting to let it hold you back okay you're not willing to have regrets anymore you're not wanting to walk around sad anymore i feel like a lot of y'all are busting out okay and y'all are taking a leap of faith towards something new okay some of y'all are dealing with the capricorn for sure we got the devil here eight of wands and the ace of cups You could be wanting someone to stop coming at you um, with with their problems or with their issues. I'm getting like some of you guys are conversing with other people, um, telling other people your ideas to see how somebody's going to respond or see how someone reacts. Somebody could also get ghosted as well. Like, you guys could be ghosting somebody. Or some of y'all dealing with the Virgo. Um, you're leaving somebody on. You're putting somebody on hold. Because you're worried about what they're going to say. How they're going to respond to something. I think right now, you are focused on your pentacle. Um, and you may feel like you're too busy to make certain decisions. Like... Some of y'all feel like y'all are too busy to even indulge in certain things. Like, your vibe is so much higher than what somebody else is bringing to you, bringing you drama, bringing you issues, their problems, and sitting it on your table for you to help them sort out. It's like you're not even on that level or page anymore. So I'm getting like somebody's wanting to work and build and come together with you, but you're on the on the level of I don't know about that. I'm not even gonna get your hope up. I'm not even gonna tell you no lie. I'm not even gonna tell you no lie, dog. I don't know about all this because I'm focused and I'm busy on what I'm doing right now. I got this in front of me. I got this on my plate in front of me right now. So you know this is what it is. This is what it is, right? Seven of Cups. And the Knight of Wands. Oh, so somebody over here has uh, some options or they're feeling like you have other options. Yeah, they're wondering what you're thinking. Maybe I feel like y'all ghosted somebody. Now they're wondering what you're thinking. Like, what you got going on? Who you dealing with? What's, what else you got to do to where you can't deal with me? Yeah, see, they feel like y'all are being, y'all bouncing all over the place. Or y'all just too busy for them. Two of Pentacles, Ten of Cups, and the Seven of Swords. Yeah, they feel like you're too busy for them. Eight of Cups. The Lovers. Yeah, this is in your hopes and fears. Somebody making a decision to walk away and end something. The Emperor. This person could be older than you. Could be a boss. Like I said, for some of y'all, y'all are getting ready to, to leave a job. I feel like that as well, too. You're tired of this person's narcissistic behavior, like their controlling ass ways. You're tired of, you're ready to walk away from it anyway. See, yeah, the world and the Ten of Swords, like you're contemplating, contemplating closing this chapter. It's like they got one, they say one wrong thing to you. <laughs> because I feel like this is what you're busy doing. Like you're focused on this, on your pentacle, what you're building. You don't want to give them a chance to mess this up. You feel like this person messed you up or set you off track before. And like now you're so focused to where you're like, I don't, I don't, don't come in here trying to trying to mess up nothing that I got going on. Why is the king of wands here as the outcome? You could be dealing with the fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Or this is you taking action. Yep. The fool. You're, you're serious about what you got going on here. You are ready to take this, this leap of faith. You're taking this leap of faith, okay? You're taking a leap of faith, okay? Something you were on hold for a second, but I think them days is over. Right now, you're focused on your pentacle, your bag, honey. Yes. You're waiting to see what this person is going to say. I feel like you're, you're going to be spying on them a little bit. 
You're waiting to see what they're going to say. See if they're going to put in some effort to try to come towards you. Come a little harder towards you. You know? But, yeah, like... And you're also thinking about whether or not if you should say yes to this person. Because I feel like you got this person on hold. And somebody here is telling somebody some lies. Somebody here is telling somebody some lies. Somebody's wanting somebody to change their answer. <laughs> and somebody here is also regretting that they express their feelings. Like they feel like they should have stayed cold. Okay. Somebody here is also married here with the Ten of Pentacles and the Justice card. Somebody here could be uh, married. Somebody's waiting for somebody to get a divorce or waiting for somebody to get a separation or end something. Here. All right, so that's going to be the message that I have for my cancers. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe with your family and friends. If you are interested, guys, in booking a personal, that information is in the drop box below. As well, guys, check out the website. I have my handmade ritual oils over there for you guys, as well as spiritual pieces as well, all right? So y'all head over to the website. It's www.empressempireoils.com, and I'm going to chat with y'all in the next video. Ciao.